Hey there, guys. Oh, yeah. There you go, look. 12 now, folks. You can see what it says. We got this going on here. 100, 112 kilohertz. That's a little boost, boost, uh, DC boost converter circuit. And at the minute, we're set at the 250 volt range. And this piece of lovely piece of kit from China, <laughs> and it's about 100. So I don't know. Just over 150 volts anyway. So, it works. Uh, I've got a 1 millihenry inductor. Uh, I think that's a 220 ohm, um, 220 microfarad electrolytic there. That's a 400 volt, uh, I can't remember what it is actually. Hundred and a third. It says down there on the side, does it? Hundred microfarad, four hundred volt. Uh, and that's a MJE thirteen thirteen zero 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 nine. Um, MPN transistor. There's a little. Uh, 2222 two, two, two transistor down there and I think I can't remember what this leadage capacitor is here 500 560k no 560 ohm resistor I've been playing with this all day I started off playing with it just over here on this part of the board and every now and then it would it would work and it wouldn't work and it's some of the pin the connectors are a bit dodgy um, but moved it over here and I haven't had any problems since so and I've tried different inductors oh okay well that's just been a runner so I'll show you that ah, uh, this one's actually got like a little a little rod that goes in it quite good when you put it on it sucks it through yeah I lost it again there we go uh, I tried that I tried plugging it into the board not very good uh, it makes a bit of squeal when you put it on wires and try plugging it in uh, did this one I just tried loads of different inductors just to try to see what it would do. A little baby one here. Tried that as well. Tried lots of different capacitors. As you can see my bench. Yeah. Put the light up. We've got all sorts over it. And the capacitors trying to dig out. What <laughs> oh, capacitors is there? LEDs and just in general oh my life so a proper little play with this circuit but well I'm still trying to find something that can actually do meaningful okay we can put an LED on but whoopee that's not uh, I need to try and figure this out better to get it to do something better I know if I, if I can get a bit more ampage draw more power you know, I can put a 330 mic in there and then we start drawing about 400 milliamps of power on the power supply at the minute just put the wires loose with a 220 that's what we got yeah I'm using 12.6 volts because uh, that's what I'm going to be having off my batteries and that's what I want to start doing I want to start running as much as I can from the batteries I've ordered I've got like a um, 
What did I do with that last night? I got a 10 amp step down converter. I got a 100 watt step up converter on its way. And I've got another 600 watt step up converter on its way. After watching the oh, archive, what his name is. Spoke, um, spoken to me today on YouTube. Jim, someone enough her. After watching his um, testing of one of the step up converters, I thought, yeah, that'd be pretty good. I'll go for that. I just thought I'd try and see if I could build a little circuit myself. Now, this is like a, near enough a copy of Ludic Science um, with just a few changes because I've been faffing about. Uh, but I think his one's probably about, you know, about right. The, the better one out of mine and his anyway. So, yeah, I just thought I'd share that. I'm waiting for more LEDs for the cube, if anybody's wondering why I haven't finished the cube. It's partly finished, it's over there, look. Just got a few more LEDs that's needed for it. And they're sending out a whole new kit, so I've got to wait about three to four weeks. Right. There we go. And that's dropped down. I suppose that's because I put the... Uh, I can get that strap on just by putting the LED on. LED's on. Take it off and it will start climbing back up again. It's quite funny to watch the waveform take shape again as well. Hi. Anyway. Cheers for watching guys.